and hello everyone welcome back to another tutorial in this tutorial we'll be taking a look at installing Python on Windows so it's pretty simple you can just go to Google and search Python the first thing you see should be correct just make sure it's from python.org and then just click on downloads you just click download Python and you say save then here we can click on that and here you'll find your installation now please remember to click on that you will want to add Python to your path otherwise you might struggle actually using Python and then you just say install now you say yes and in Python will begin installing while we're waiting for that let's go and create ourselves a new folder let's call it py and here we can create a new file and we can call it main let's try that again main.py yes we're going to right click and open with and you can choose what you want to open it with I prefer Visual Studio Code so I'll pick that and first thing you need to make sure of is if you go here to the files and it should actually be here but actually let's just go here we trust this folder okay then this main.py we can actually drag this folder right there and it will actually open up the folder and just say yes I trust make sure this is .py and not .py.txt some of you might see .py.txt like this if it's like this it's a text file and not a Python file and you won't get syntax highlighting or whatever with it so make sure it is .py and not .py.txt so like that once you have confirmed that you can just say print hello world and make sure to use quotes it can be single or double quotes and make sure to use brackets and yeah once you've done that make sure to go file and save make sure you save this file if you don't save this file it won't be able to work and here it says new to Python okay we just say disable path length limit you could do this that's up to you I'll actually allow that and then once that is done you can say close and now you should be able to go to this right here terminal new terminal and it will open up a terminal for you to run this code you can say python main.py and if I were to resize it a little bit, it will look like that. And there you go. If you get hello world in return, it means everything has been installed correctly and you are good to go and to follow along with the tutorial. If something here doesn't work, like it says Python is not found, that means you need to try and install Python again. Maybe you didn't add Python to your path during installation. You will need to do that. And note that if you did not drag, this folder into here if you did not that do that you may not find main.py make sure you're in this folder if you're not sure you can just pull from there drop it in here and it will take you there if you go and say cd meaning change directory or change folder and it will take you to that folder where you can then run python main.py and that is that thank you all for watching I hope you all enjoyed and I will see you all again in the next Python tutorial.